They help me ducks. And we're all still doing uh, doing well. Thought I'd uh, see if this day why I've uh, got the chance why it's not too late and uh, get out in this uh, glorious sunshine once again. more of this sunshine to come uh, as the year progresses and uh, the lockdown ends and we can all get out properly and enjoy it I've just re started recording this bit guys because uh, I'm hoping There you go, oh I just missed it I think there's one more in the tree Damn it You probably heard it I saw two of them fly into this tree Flew off. I'm sure I saw two. Oh, there you go. Wow. Hopefully, the camera picked that up, and uh, I think the mic would have picked it up. zoom too much because this is a phone and it's busy to zoom obviously it'll get it gets wobbly and uh, all pixelated or blocky when you use a digital zoom too much but, uh, how cool was that there oh there we go with the call again uh, I mean I'm sure it's still going I'll be chastised for, going, for not knowing this, but uh, definitely some sort of predator birds, 
some sort of uh, forks or something. Hopefully you can still see them hovering up in the uh, hovering in the sky in the distance. Waiting to uh, detect prey so they can swoop down into the field and uh, capture it with their talons. That's the first time I've seen those at you. Absolutely brilliant. Well chuffed I've just spotted these. Obviously they're, I'm assuming they're a breeding pair. Absolutely brilliant. So chuffed I caught that guys. I, hopefully you guys saw enough of them to enjoy them. As you can probably see, this is a. It's a. It's going a bit uh, a bit dark over Bill's mother's. Some uh, dirty clouds coming in, guys. So uh, I think possibly we're in for a bit of rain. But uh, I'm not too bad. I've got waterproof coat with me. Another lightweight waterproof in my bag. So. Waterproof trousers as well, so I should be right. I'm just following a path that I've not been on before. I've been on parts of it, but not, you know. So uh, I'm just seeing where this uh, goes. I've got kind of an idea where it will end up, but uh, we shall see. Right, hope you enjoyed that little shot of the uh, birds of prey. Good God, have you seen this, guys? <laughs> this uh, definitely weren't built to let fatties through, was it? No disrespect to uh, people of uh, a more rotund nature, obviously, but uh, yeah, it's almost like the farmer didn't uh, really want us to be walking through his field. So unusual for a farmer, that is. <laughs> Sarcasm. Right then. Back in and on.
live squirrel. <laughs> Hello, squirrel. I wish I had some food on me there. It's obviously used to uh, being fed by humans around here. <laughs> See if it comes to me. No, it's going away. Oh, sorry for the shaky. Uh... Ah, I ain't got no food on me. Uh -huh. <laughs> Come on, squirrel. I ain't gonna hurt you. Come and say hello. It looks like it's well fed anyway, it's got a fat belly, unless it's pregnant. <laughs> it's not going to come to me, is it? Let's see how close I can get to it. No, there you go. Okay, you take care, squirrel. You know what's coming there, you guys? I up my ducks. Well, you know, it's got to be done, hasn't it? It's got to be done. <laughs> it's, a, uh, it's a day of ponds today, isn't it, guys? Another one here. Carpark, Manor Floods, Peewee Carpark. Another lovely old bridge here, guys. I'm sure I put this on the video previously, but hey ho. And guess what, guys? We have us another pond. <laughs> This is called uh, locally known as uh, Swan Lake. And you can probably see why. Lots of all these uh, swans. I almost got the perfect picture of these two swans here, what we're looking at now. You know when they put the heads together and they make like a, a love art shape? I almost captured it. Oh, go on. I've wanted to capture that for ages. And then I could make a, take a still of my video and get it into a picture. I think Father in law actually managed to capture him doing that. And it did do a perfect love art. It looks brilliant. There, babe, Swannies. Ain't got no food for you. Sorry. Again, I say that every time I see one, don't I? It's good when there's a shed load of seagulls here and they, they suddenly scare and they all take flight. It's like, Jesus, duck! <laughs> duck, we've been attacked. You have to watch your head there because uh, seagulls, or better known as shy talks, uh, yeah, are known for that for a good reason. <laughs> I've been uh, bombed on more than one occasion by a uh, seagull and I'm sure they do it on purpose, you know. Right then guys, 15 minutes. I've been told 15 minutes is kind of maximum before people start getting bored unless you're doing something amazingly interesting. <laughs> so, uh, please drop a like on my video if you would be so kind and uh, once again if you didn't like it, 
just lie and drop a like anyway and I love you forever uh, if you've not subscribed please subscribe and if you do subscribe please press that notifications bell yada 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 yada, yada. and uh, yeah love you guys God can't you tell the difference of a person's mood there's some mates bloody hell anyway guys take care much love